Hey Pisces, thank you for tuning in with me for this weekly message. Please take whatever resonates and leave whatever don't. <sighs> Pisces is the last reading. I am tired. Tired, tired, sleepy. Alright, let's see what's going on for you, Pisces. What is the message spirit? Pisces. Pisces, we have Mercury retrograde, so it could be some issues with communication, issues with traveling, or issues with electronics. We have patience. Just a few more months, good things come to those who wait. We have commitment, things are getting serious, and someone got their eye on you. Someone is trying to do some research, trying to investigate something like that let's see more on this energy show us more on this commitment for pisces show us more on the commitment for pisces show us more on commitment so you could be leveling up uh your connection if you are dating you could be uh Deciding to make this more exclusive. Um, you and uh, someone could be taking things to the next level with engagement or getting married. Or Let's see more on this commitment. Show us more on commitment for Pisces. Ace of Swords. Communication coming in about commitment. About, you know... What someone want with you or what you want with them. It could be a cancer with the chariot. Show us more on the chariot and the ace of swords. For some of you, this could be you signing a contract due to like a vehicle. So maybe you're getting a new car as well. Yes, yeah, some documents that you could be signing. Someone is wanting to express their feelings to you, or this is you wanting to go towards a fire sign, Aries Leo, Sagittarius, to express your feelings. But someone could be like, kind of like shutting someone out. Someone could be not interested, or maybe this is what happened. Shows more. Yeah, Eight of Swords. Someone feels stuck. A fire sign may feel stuck. Someone could be saying that they want to move on. They want to close out a cycle with you. Okay, this just went all the way left. I wasn't expecting that. I was trying to bring in the... Alright. So, it could be a, uh, a talk. A it could be a conversation about closing out a cycle. Someone want to free themselves, they feel stuck. They're ready to close out a cycle with you or you with them. Take it however, due to this commitment. So, some Whether this was a commitment due to the relationship, however this was. It's like, okay, I'm ready to, I'm ready to end this. Whatever you had, um, whatever you gr agreed upon, someone have a change, change of heart, change of plans. Okay. Whether this is you or this person. Someone could be going to jail. Someone could be wanting to get married. Like, <laughs> not get married when they went to go to jail. Or they got married. Or they got, uh, they went to jail and they asking you to marry them. <laughs> um, but that's for some. Someone just feel like they're. They're stuck in a situation. They want out. This could be you. Yeah, someone feel like they're in. The, it's just an illusion. Someone just wanted them for some money or six of pentacles. Someone just wanted to invest to feel more superior. Like someone wanted to feel like they had the upper hand. Like yeah, I. Who reading that was? Someone was like, I got y'all me. I don't know, but show us more on this energy for Pisces. Yeah, someone want to be free. 
the full. Some I want to just let's see another deck because what show us a message for Pisces. What is going on for Pisces? Someone is definitely looking like they want to be free. They're tired of feeling stuck, tied down to someone. Show us a message for Pisces. And someone could be trying to come in and apologize and someone else does not want to hear it. So maybe this is an ex-lover. Show us more on this energy or an ex-lover is not wanting to hear it from you, Pisces. Please take it however it resonates. We got receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, closure issues. Yeah. Someone is, is one person that's having an issue with closing out a cycle. And the other person is feeling stuck because someone won't close out the cycle. Show us more. We have sunglasses, watching, looking, stalking, gaslight, and perception. We're focusing out. What else for Pisces? self indulge focus on self, self-work, time to heal, shadow work, of self-appreciation. Yes, the love not there no more. The Cupid's arrow in reverse. So it's like you don't want this love with this person or someone lost love for someone. Show us more. The snake, competition, enemy, clever, malicious, look over your shoulder, the other woman, the other man. Yeah, someone is uh, rejecting someone because someone realized they're just in competition. We got needs time, takes time, end time, cycles, time to heal, progress. And then we have a relationship evolving to the next phase, healing the inner child, um, growth, clarity, truth. So it looked like the truth is someone is wanting another relationship, another connection. They want to end things. Because they want something different. They don't want this no more. Or you don't want this no more. Take it however. Someone is not wanting this no more. Dang, this girl with the snake. The snake. You got the snake and the girl with the snake. What the heck? You got a narcissist being charmed and used and able boundaries. Someone need to set boundaries. There's a separation. Sadness. Missing you. Thinking about you. Yearning. Unsure of the future. This is how someone is feeling. We got acts, breakup, separation, stop the pattern, silent treatment, abandonment. Yes, something is repetitive, outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. Someone, someone felt like this is just, you know, a broken record, like it's just on repeat. <laughs> like, or, yeah, someone need to heal. Heal from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationships or addictions. If this person is um, rejecting you, that, and, and you, and you keep wanting this, that should let you know you need to heal from this. You need to heal from whatever is causing you to still want this. For someone to keep hurting you, rejecting you, or making you feel less than, or whatever, it's because it's some healing that needs to be taking place within self. Once you do that healing, someone rejecting you, you're like, okay, all right, if that's what you want, you know, without having any uh revenge uh any ill will against that person because they don't want you or you know that's how you know you heal when you haven't healed you want to get some get back oh you don't want me i'm gonna hurt you i'm gonna cause this and that and or just be deceptive with doing it without telling them like yeah that someone mm -mm. someone need to heal so if this is not you this could be the person you're dealing with but someone needs to let go because think about it like you just wrap you racking up karma. You gonna uh I'm saying you, but it could be the other way around. I'm just speaking. But you know, someone could be racking up karma that way. Um because if you you're given a chance to let this go, walk away, do your healing, and then you get blessed with the connection that is for you. A connection that is good for you and you're able to open your heart to it you're able to accept it because you've done the healing then it's like what you missing out on nothing you gained your lesson because that's what it was that was a lesson now let's get ready for your blessing that's what this is so it's, it's an ending for a new beginning but someone could be having a hard time with closure or just gaining that closure or um, ending a cycle with someone It's like someone is wanting someone 
to speak to them, tell them why. But they, someone may already told, told you may have already told this person why. Eight of Cups, Spirit, like walk away, close this out, the world again. It's time for a close. Dang, this been coming up kind of. Now that I think about it, yeah, this been coming up quite a bit in your readings a little bit. So I don't know if it's you or the other person that is having a hard time with letting go. I know, like Pisces, you're a water sign. You love deeply, but at the same time, you can't hold on to something that is no longer holding on to you, or vice versa. If I'm talking to cross washer, washer, you just gotta let go, so you can receive your blessings. It's like you in a situation that you're not too fond of. Like you dealt with it because you love this person. You you said okay to an open relationship. This person don't even want an open relationship with you. They may have or you don't even want an open relationship with this person. It's like I don't even want that. I just want to go. Like someone just want to be free. <laughs> Pisces, you done had it up to here. Like I'm, I'm just over this. Yeah. You're over it. Show us more on this energy or they're over it. So this could have been a contract due to a marriage or something. Someone could be a dark male. Someone could be a dark complected. Or someone could um, be going towards a dark male. We have dating queen in reverse. Yeah, someone is going from single to in a relationship. Once you release the connection. This past person. Or this past person needs to release you. Communication. Yeah, some of you. Yeah, communication is none. Someone is not communicating. It could be some gossip about this. So someone could be dealing with a fair male. Someone could be light-skinned. You could be. This masculine be, could be whoever. It doesn't matter. But um, it's some gossip surrounding this person and who they're dealing with at a distance. Someone could have a family at a distance. And someone feels some type of way about that. Twin flame. Someone could have a twin flame. Someone could be saying that they're the twin flame and it's not. It's the, someone else. Or you're, you know, the other person is your twin flame. Or the other person is this person's twin flame. Something like that. Show us more. Friendship. They're saying just build a friendship. That's it. Like, if you have children, yeah. Work on a friendship with this person. But if it's no children, like, just learn a lesson out of it and let it go. Because it's like, how can you be friends? Like, mm -mm. especially with someone who's having closure issues. It'll be better to just have a conversation to go your separate ways and just let that be and learn from it. Gain your lesson so you can go towards your soulmate, your soulmate, your real soulmate, or your real twin flame, rather. Someone is, is, is cold and someone could be very narcissistic and someone does not want to talk. Someone is just, someone is not happy here. Someone is not happy, they want to release, they want to go. But it's an obstacle because someone is wanting control. I know, but I'm your true love. <laughs> yeah, this is what I'm getting. Like, no, but I'm your true love. Someone is trying to control someone, manipulate someone, cause obstacles. <sighs> It's like someone is trying to block the block someone from having love elsewhere, but then some. It's like someone is trying to block someone from having love elsewhere, but yet they can have love with whoever they want. Or this is you. You you want your options, but you won't let this person have have a uh, new love. So take it however. Yeah, exactly. Some of them want new love. It's a new love. But it's gossip. It's, 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 it's jealousy here. It's just it's jealousy and control. Some of it, someone is gossiping like, oh, they're not mature. They're immature. They this, that. They're not da, da, da. Because they don't want to be with someone. So someone is, in a, someone is you know, speaking negatively on them. That's not right. That's how you know you need to heal. Um, yeah, showing up again. Someone have a family at a distance or someone could be finding this out or have found this out. Someone's brother could have said this or family member could have said this to someone. That's how someone found out. Mature woman. 
someone could be dating someone older. Um, could be an age gap. Yeah. Ooh, this is uh, nerve-wracking. It's it's a lot of masculines here. <laughs> it's, only, it's only one female. What's going on, Pisces? Talk to me. Talk to me. <laughs> it's three masculines here and one female. So it's a Pisces feminine dealing with all these men, but don't want to. Wait, let me find out, Pisces. Tell me about it. Or this could be like an ex, ex of yours that can't let you go. You're trying to move on into another connection, but you got your exes that don't want to let you go. And making it, you know, more complicated for you to move on. Oof. So who is this spying? Spirit, show us. Who is spying? Who is doing this spying in Pisces reading? Who is doing this spying in Pisces reading? Who is spying? Pisces? You, <laughs> you spying. Wow. Wow. Someone um, could be spying through divination, dark arts as well with the high priest. Someone could be Sam. Like someone is, whew, show us more. But Pisces, yeah. It's, I say who's spying and it's showing you. Show us more. The high priestess in reverse. The hermit. Someone looking hard too. Someone trying to investigate, find out all the... All the tea. <laughs> On this emperor. An emperor or a father figure or Aries could be doing it. Show us. Are you, you the one spying? Someone gaining some truth though. And someone is sad. They're regretting the past. They feel guilty for their choice. Show us more on the Five of Cups. Justice. The justice, the tower. Yeah, the justice is someone is receiving the truth. Gaining clarity and truth. Oof. About the devil who was toxic. Show us more on this devil. Clarify the devil. Queen of Pentacles. Someone, someone could be married to this person. Or it could be an Aquarius Libra Gemini. Someone could have been lying. Cheating. Yeah, someone spied and found some information out. About someone um marriage or about someone um yeah, someone could have been lying about being single but they're married. Someone could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries Leo Sagittarius. Someone is no longer indecisive. They're ready to take action. Aries. The will of fortune. To change this. Get this flowing. Get this going. Someone may want marriage. The sun. Someone is gaining, someone is gaining a whole lot of clarity on someone. They're seeing someone for who they are. Yeah, there was a lot of secrets here. Someone is trying to heal there was a lot of secrets. Truth is coming to light. And now they're trying to bring balance, restore balance from all this betrayal. The Sagittarius could have betrayed you, or you betrayed the Sagittarius, or a Pi another Pisces, or a Cancer, or an Aries. But there's some betrayal here. Someone is being neglected, rejected. Someone is working on what? Someone is trying to apologize or working on an apology. Towards you or towards the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone is wanting to balance things out, but someone feels left out in the cold now. And they don't know what to do. Or you don't know what to do. Take action with leaving this behind. Leave this, leave this behind. That's what someone needs to do. This is, it's, it needs to be left behind. Like if it's that much deceit, lies, betrayal... Why continue something like you can't you can't trust this person and or they can't trust you however this go. Someone needs to again heal their heart. Healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationships or addictions. Yep. 
All right, Pisces, that's all I have for you. Your guardian angel is watching over you, helping you, heal you, and trying to push you forward or push this person person away from you. Take it however it resonates. Uh, but that is it. Until next time, many blessings.